that video calling for adult only flights. We should refer to the fact that they want an age, a minimum age, not adult only in some context that Sarah Frazier would take it to. <laughs> uh, the 24 year old says she heard a child cry throughout her entire three hour flight, even as she was wearing noise canceling headphones. The comments have been mixed. Some agreeing that a childless flight would be nice. Others saying she needs to be more accepting of other people's situations. So let's go to the only mother on the panel, Sarah. What do you think about adult only flights? Look, I'm here for it. I mean, you know, I used to bitch about these kids on airplanes all the time till I had one. Now I'm on the flight. Oh, trying to like get my kid to be quiet, asking strangers for favor. You know, it's always like life always comes full circle. But I don't blame people. When I was like young, I always dreaded getting on like an airplane next to sitting next to a kid. And I mean, now I'm on there and I'm like, oh, isn't my kid so cute? Will you like hold the diaper bag? It's terrible. <laughs> I mean, you see this, right? Like you're about to board and you see all the groups that are going ahead of you and you're like, oh my gosh, those kids, I can see them crying. Like you already can anticipate the ones that's gonna be shrieking throughout your six hour flight out west. Yeah, I'm here for it. I say I'll pay an extra whatever it is to get on a flight where at least I don't have like that constant, like will I be having my seat constantly kicked by a two year old that just can't sit still? Like I get it. I understand that you can't tame all the children, but I also would like to enjoy a little tranquility. Uh, anytime, Michael, that I bring anything up to this extent, people People say, as a yeah. man, I do not have a right to weigh in on, on this on. one. Yes, I, 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 that's not true. I mean, you're sitting on the plane, uh, and when you're at the gate and you kind of you see the kids crying, you just pray. You pray <laughs> that they don't sit by you, but they're always next to you. Just, I, I, I like the idea. I remember being a kid, being a lifeguard. You, you, you made all the kids get out of the pool. You let the adults swim a little bit. But if you're going to pay extra money, just buy yourself a first class ticket. If you have extra money to pay for a, an adult only flight, and, and then you don't have to worry about any of that stuff. Wait, they let kids on first class, Michael. Yeah, but you're far, Marina, you're far away. That's you, like you the ultimate, own. like this, when you're playing like triple on, the price like and you got a kid. Hold, hold on a second. What have you become? Like, do you not have any New Jersey left in you that you just so cavalierly oh. said, oh, just take a first class flight? Let me tell you what happened, Jim. So it was <laughs> yes. a few months ago, and I was taking my lowly little coach ticket back to New Jersey <laughs> yeah. for cousin's wedding or something, mm -hmm. and they gave me an upgrade. And they only charged me like 50 bucks for it. And, and I have not sat in, in, uh, in coach since, and I have no money now. So, yeah. <laughs> you can't go back. I've, yeah, I've become very bougie. New Jersey's all gone. Okay. I, 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 I applaud that. I applaud that. All right.